Our region's crime problem is what prompted News 4 to start Imagine a Better St. Louis. We tell you stories about St. Louis's positive people and places. We started looking around the country and St. Louis quickly popped up on our radar. 60% of our portfolio companies will come from outside the region. 14 years ago, Washington University and other partners initially invested $29 million to kickstart the Cortex Innovation Community. Technology entrepreneurs have generated millions of dollars in economic activity, and now thousands of people are making millions of dollars in a development right by IKEA that's expected to hit the billions. Construction crews continue the crafting of the Cortex Innovation Community. All these cranes represent, you know, progress and growth in the region. Travis Sheridan runs the nonprofit Venture Cafe Foundation at Cortex. I, we came from California. Travis and his St. Louis native wife Gina left the Golden State for the Gateway City four years ago. And I worked in the area of startups and so we started looking around the country and St. Louis quickly popped up on our radar where we saw this whole growing startup community. Now his company helps connect innovators to Cortex where startups coexist with the established. Boeing has made a significant presence here and then you have Square and Pandora and Uber all officing out of here right alongside the startups. The Cortex Innovation Community sits where the Central West End meets Midtown by the IKEA that opened up last fall. Cortex was founded in 2002. And since then, developers have pumped a half billion dollars into the district, where 3,800 people work for $210 million in yearly wages so far. We see over 500 applications a year. Judy Syndicus founded Capital Innovators in 2010. Every year, her company plants seed money in roughly a dozen tech startups in the hopes they grow in St. Louis. The vast majority of the companies decide to stay. 64 companies, only four have gone somewhere else. Right. She says that's partly because entrepreneurs build foundations in a community that's business friendly. A lot of companies will actually come here from places like New York or D.C or Seattle or Los Angeles, all places that are much more expensive. Since the innovation cost is cut, job creation is increased. We've created over 600 jobs uh, throughout my companies. Andre Hepkins, News 4. And, you know, they're just at the beginning because, you know, a lot of people know the neighborhood because of mm -hmm. the new Ikea, right. but they don't know what's going on around that. And they're only at the half a billion dollar development mark, and they, they're they going to quadruple that. They expect oh, yeah. it to be a two billion dollar development there. There's so much going on right there, and I love hearing how people from great places, San Francisco, all over the place, over the place are coming here to St. Louis. This is a place where technology startups can happen. People are doing it all the time. Great stuff. All right.